So students tell me all the time that they love the magic hexagon, so I thought I would show you. It's basically a way of remembering the Pythagorean identities for uh, trigonometry in A-level maths. So what do we have? Tan is sine over cos. That's the first three. Now, opposite everything, but it's reciprocal. So the reciprocal of tan is cot, the reciprocal of sec, sine is cosec, and the reciprocal of cos is sec. If you find those hard to remember, here's a little trick for you. Look at the third letter of each of the reciprocal functions. So that third letter is an S, and that first letter is an S, and they're the reciprocals of each other. And cos x and sec x, the third letter is C, the first letter is C, they match, and tan x and cot x. Third letter is T, first letter is T, they match. So that's a nice little way of remembering it. So reciprocal of cosec of sine x is cosec x, reciprocal of tan x is cot x, the reciprocal of cos x is sec x. And then in the middle, we're going to put a number one. Now, everybody remembers that sine squared x plus cos squared x is one. All of these are going to be squared because I'm doing the Pythagorean identities, which are all squared um, to do with squared trig functions. So we have got sine squared plus cos squared is 1. Now that little arrow shape repeats itself round the hexagon. So here it is again, and here it is again. And what this is going to be really useful for is for us to memorise and see which trig identity is going to be useful. So times when you will use this, for example, you're going to use it when you are converting um, parametric to Cartesian functions. You can use it any time you're doing a trig proof or a trig equation and you need the identity and you want to be sure that you've got it the right way around. You're going to be using it in integration. So if, for example, you want to integrate tan squared or cot squared, then you would need these. So you use them all the time. So what are the identities? The identities are sine squared x plus cos squared x is 1. Follow the arrow. 1 plus cot squared is cosec squared x, I should say x. 1 plus cot squared x is cosec squared x. Tan squared x plus 1 is sec squared x. Really, really nice way, I think, and students have told me that they love it. So I thought I would share it with you all on the toolkit.